Senator Hoskins, I'm just thankful you have some words left. What'd you do, two hours on the floor, two and a half today? I believe it was about two hours. Yeah. Break it down, give me like the house, no, instead of Cliff Notes, the house version of what you took to the floor today and what you, what you set out to accomplish. Well, what we wanted to accomplish and really talk about was honesty, integrity, and, and honor in the Senate. And it, as a senator, you are only as good as a person of your word. And we feel like we've had um, a lack of disrespect, a lack of, lack of honesty, a lack of truthfulness uh, by some of our Republican leadership when it's come to uh, deals that were struck at the end of session, uh, when it was, came to veto session, and we were told one thing, that we would just uh, gavel in and gavel out, and there was no need to come, and, and actually it was gavel in, signy die, and gavel out, and, and a few other uh, mishaps where our Republican leadership has, has basically not told. There was something I thought was interesting. You and Senator Igo were, were having an inquiry, and you both said that you did not want the choppy waters. You wanted calm waters. Do you think, and in, in right now, after caucus, after some of the things today, is, it, is there really a path for the Republican caucus to find those calm waters? I believe that there is a path, and that's what, that's what we want. That's what I want. That's what I believe many of my Senate colleagues want, whether they're identified as part of the conservative caucus or they're just conservative centers or some of the more moderate centers. And, and so my hope is that we can have uh, some consensus, uh, work with our colleagues across the aisle, um, you know, Senator Roberts, Senator Washington, and, and come to consensus. But you know, right now, with that level of trust broken, it's very hard uh, to see that going.